Okay, so we're working on this uh, 2019 uh, Ram 1500 Eco Diesel. Just wanted to show we've got a, uh, a coolant leak internal to the EGR cooler, which is uh, causing it to go through coolant, which isn't good. So temporary fix here and or semi-permanent if you wanted to, uh, to go that far without actually replacing the EGR cooler and you wanted to just uh, delete the whole thing. So there was a uh, there's an inlet hose here on the front side right there on the EGR uh, cooler inlet there and then there's and there was another connection on the back side here um, and there was a, a bit of a, a little pipe on either side so yeah on the front side of the EGR cooler we had a this pipe here that went down to another pipe on the block so I've removed that pipe and then plugged the end of it with a rubber plug down there with that clamp and uh, that's uh, some kits will come with a, a little plate that would normally go on the end of the existing steel pipe here uh, just a plate to cover that end but I just took it off of the off of the pipe down there and put a cap on it then on the on the outside on the outlet sorry that goes to the then the, that then goes to the heater core there was this here so this pipe here connected it's actually this way around this pipe connected that lower pipe down there with that silver clamp to a little extension uh, extension a piece of 5 8 uh, heater hose that I put in so this basically uh, omits this whole piece and allows you to then now uh, run I've got a, literally a, a three quarter by one inch piece of uh, a, a PEX brass PEX adapter and then another uh, adapter here just for this little extension so that we're, we don't have the heater hose resting on that hot exhaust back there. So, so yeah, this basically bypasses the entire EGR cooler and, um, you know, until you need to replace it and or if you so wish to delete it, then uh, you can get it tuned out and uh, avoid having to take the whole thing off and all the work associated with it.